welcome back to my channel. This is Stephanie with the gym. Thank you for watching. For those who are new to my channel, please subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Also, give my video a thumbs up because it helps out my channel. And in today's video, we're going to go ahead and continue on with my shipments from Ipsy. I had quite a few. There were some that I forgot to show a while back. So let's just continue with that. We're going to go ahead and start off with a more recent purchase. It came in this. It came in today in the mail in this bag. Okay, so let's get started with this. So let me see. Let me go ahead and get my account open so we can see what I paid for on these items. All right, so you see inside the bag, you can see another Ipsy bag in here. And then we have a mystery bag. Yes, we have a mystery bag. How exciting, right? I haven't done mystery bags for a while and I just kind of, you know, I'd watch CC trial sized um, live. I'll go ahead and put her channel here in the description bar. I watch her and um, she does a lot of uh, mystery bundle unboxings, you know, from Ipsy. And um, I don't know, this time, this month I was just inspired in like buying, you know, buying some mystery bundles. I had bought some before um, a while ago. <laughs> I had bought some mystery bundles as well. Okay, so this is the one with the glitter. I love glitter. Personally, I love glitter. It's a mess. So I don't care for it that much, but I do love glitter. I know it can be messy. So I, I, um, I use glitter sparingly. I don't use glitter all the time. As you can tell, I don't use glitter all the time. Even though my name is called Glitzy Gem and is derived by glitter and gems. And so that's why I'm called Glitzy Gem. Because I love anything shiny and um, and sparkly. So, <laughs> hence Glitzy Gem. So, and this is this bag is one of those bags that Cece does not like. Cece does not like these kind of bags. Uh, they're the ones that, you know, where the glitter just fall off. Uh, I'm not seeing any anything falling off. Oh yeah, I did. I I do see little specks falling off on on my table here, but um, I love glitter. So this is a gold glitter with the pink uh, faux leather flap here. The back also is pink faux leather, and it has the name Ipsy. Okay, so let's go ahead and open up this mystery bundle. Uh, $14, that's how much it was. It was either $14, yeah, that's how much the mystery bundles are, they're $14. Um, I can check my account to be sure. <laughs> okay, yes, this was $14, it's called All That Glitters Mystery Bag. Okay, so let's see. That's the reason why I got it, because um, I wanted some, I wanted to see what, I was curious to find out you know, what was in the All That Glitters mystery bag. I'm thinking, are they going to give you everything that glitters in this bag? So, we'll go ahead and see. Um, the lining is real pretty. It's the same color as the faux leather flap and bag. And then it has the Ipsy logo here. There is no card in here in the mystery bundles. I don't give you any cards or anything like that. So, um, let's pull out this first item here. This is by the, I don't know if it's a uh, Kwa or Uwe, Uwe or Uwa brand. This is a scalp and body scrub. Let me see, I've got to, I've got to see how this smells. It, oh, it smells wonderful. Oh my God, it smells like something in my childhood, something clean and fresh in my childhood that I would wear when I was, I guess, when I would take my showers. Oh, I can't, or, or it, was, it was a perfume. I cannot hint, I cannot pinpoint the scent, but it smells really, really good. It's not strongly fragranced. It smells really nice and clean. So I recommend it for those who, you know, who are sensitive to fragrances. Um, Depending on how sensitive you are, if you, if you can't stand any kind of fragrance at all, then I wouldn't recommend this to you. But it's not a bad scent at all. 
my goodness i can smell this all day so this is how it looks like on the inside looks like almost half of it is gone doesn't it <laughs> you see this half right here is kind of empty and there's not really much on this cap either oh my god i can't wait to try this on my scalp and my body so i'm gonna put this in the in the bath in the shower as soon as as soon as i get off this as soon as i finish this video so the next thing in here is the papaya balm glow lip mask all right let's see what's in here so far i'm liking the products that are in this bag um i like lip masks um i just have so many of them that's the reason why i kind of like tend not to i tend to not you know try to get anything with lip, lip masks in them as much uh this is supposed to be a boost of hydration and glow with this uh protective lip mask lip mask formulated with apricot uh, jojoba rose hip and papaya seed oils that work uh synergistically to keep lips chap free soothe and plumped at the same time made with papaya and acerola i think acerola is cherry so um let's let me see if you're able if i'm, if I'm able to smell it through the seal i do smell i do smell a scent through the seal and it is um like uh like a sweet scent but like an edible sweet scent that's what it smells like um fruity sweet edible scent like i can smell the cherry in here i can smell the cherry not so much of a pie but i can smell cherry in here like there's some some notes of cherry in here can't wait to try it yes <laughs> Oh my goodness, I can't wait to try it. Oh, it smells so good. And it smells good enough to eat. That's the second item from this bag. The third item in this bag, I have this already is the Ciate London uh, Wonderland Mascara. This is something they had given us in our, um, in another mystery bag that I purchased last year. And yeah, it's already, I still haven't used the other one yet, but this is the wand. It's like an hourglass shaped wand. It reminds me of one of the brand name, high a brand like high end brand name mascaras with the hourglass shape. So that's the third item in my bag. The fourth item in here is the I already have one like this. Is the Gold Faden MD Problem Deep Lines Needleless Line Smoothing Concentrate. I had purchased this in, in like in an add on last year. And they gave they gave it to us in this bag. The last and fifth item that I'm, that I'm wanting to try out it's a, it's a lip oil. It's a tinted lip oil, and it's in the shade Beach Please. Beach Please tinted lip oil. I'm sure you can see the name here. It's kind of small, so I don't know if you'll be able to see the name there. But yeah, I love the shade. Really nice shade. So. That is everything that I got in this mystery bag. I really liked everything that was in here. I love the bag, considering you know that it has a glitter. You know, it, it does it, it falls, but it's not falling like a lot of, not a lot of it is falling. You know, it's just randomly, you know, sparing me. <laughs> now the next one here is another mystery bundle, a recent one that I purchased. And it's the one that's everybody that everybody's been actually showing on on YouTube right now. I've been watching a lot of YouTube. I've been off of work today. I've been off of work for a little while. Um, so, and it's it's a great rest being off of work. Uh, great rest to be away from all the stress at work. So, um, yeah. So this is what everybody's been showing on YouTube here lately which is this nice heart-shaped bag I, this is the reason why I got this mystery one is the I think that this is the limited edition well I think they're all limited edition this is the your eyes only limited edition mystery bag okay yeah it's limited edition the other one didn't say this one didn't say limited edition so this one did and it's for your eyes only $14 as well it came with a firma um, brush Kind of looks like when you would use for like blush or contouring. 
has an angle to it, so. So it, it comes with a brush. That's the first item. It was in the mailer. But I love this bag. Look how beautiful this bag looks. Doesn't that look beautiful? With heart shapes. It's like a heart shaped quilted faux leather um, bag. And I love the zipper gripper. It's a shape of a heart. I love hearts. Uh, hearts are my favorite shape of all the shapes that we have. Heart is, is my favorite shape. It has the word Ipsy on the gripper if you haven't seen that yet. Okay, so let's open this up so we know we have one item out of the mailer. The second item in here is the Ultra Repair Oil Control Moisturizer, safe for sensitive skin, non comedogenic I'll be testing it out. And this is not the only one I have. I think I have more of these. I think um, I think I have maybe one more of these. I'm not sure. Maybe I've been trying to avoid them. <laughs> That's the second item. The third item in this bag is the R & Co. Water Flaw Moisture Shine Lotion. Uh, Jen Jen, if you haven't seen her, I'll go ahead and put her description uh, down in I'll put her link in the description down below. Um, her name is called Jen Jen. And she loves this stuff. I remember her saying in one of her Mass Mondays, or I think in one of the um, her empties, she had emptied this out, and it was the Arnco Waterfall Moisture Shine Lotion, and, and um, I had got it before in another order because I wanted to see how this performed. As she liked, and I wanted to see how how you know I wanted to see I wanted to try it out, but it was for the hair, so it's, it's a, it was a, a hair lotion. So, um, I'll be trying one out and I'll be giving one away to Jen. So Jen, shout out to you, Jen. And I'll be, um, sending you one of these Arnco, um, waterfall moisture shine lotions. Okay. Cause I know you love them so much. Um, I also have this sugar mad as hell crown, uh, lipstick in the shade Miss Rosa. Miss Rosa. I already have this shade in my collection, so that might go in a giveaway. My last item in here is the Ariza Beauty uh, Royalty Shimmer Eyeshadow. I, I sent CC a message in her video when she was uh, showing her mystery bag that, um, oh my goodness, it looks like it's broken. You can you can already see like little specks of eyeshadow already on here, so I'm going to have to call it see on that. Um, she was already, you know, um, I was mentioning to her, you know, that I don't like, I really, I'm not really, I don't really care too much for the Ariza, the Ariza, um, eyeshadow palettes because they tend to kind of, like, it gets like, uh, humidity inside the pan to where it gets kind of hard to, uh, pick up color with the brush. It almost feels like you have to start using your finger to use the, the shades that are in the pan. So that's the reason why I really don't care too much for this brand, the Ariza. And this is the Royalty Shimmer Palette. Oh, hope it's not broken. Please don't let it be broken. Okay. Oh, thank God it's not broken. <laughs> it is not broken, but I like this. I like these colors. Um, um, it's They're up my alley, so I like these colors. I know Cece didn't like hers. They don't like these colors for sure. But um, I like these colors. These are not so bad. I am, I can work with these colors. Like I said, you really have to use, if you start using it, you need to continue using the palette because like I said, it'll start to um, become humid in the pan. Like the pan will become human. Humid. Human. It'll become human, right? <laughs> It'll become humid. And like I said, you'll have to use your finger to start using it to apply it on your, on your eye, eyeballs. I was gonna say eyeballs. Eyelids. So that is it. That's everything that I've that I got in these two recent bundles that I purchased. So uh, you leave your comments down below. Let me know which one was your favorite bundle. Which one was your favorite bag? Um, they're they're both the same price. You know. Um, let me know if you don't like them either. You know, or um, you know. Or if it's something that y'all wouldn't buy. <laughs> Just leave your comments down below. I really would like to 
to hear what y'all have to say. Thank you guys for watching. I really do appreciate it. Uh, taking time from your day to watch my video. Really do appreciate it. I love you all. Thank you and have a good day. Bye. Mwah.